the Church of Scientology, everything, every rhythm, every action goes from Thursday 2 o'clock to Thursday 2 o'clock, where every single thing is statusized. Like how many crates of Coca-Cola have you shipped to Disney? How many, how many heads of coca Everything is started. How many letters written out? How much? The most important statistic is revenue. Money, cash, that's what counts. Not how many people are happy, how many new people came in. Not, not. The most important stat is revenue. And this gets so absurd, this Thursday to Thursday, two o'clock, that when, <laughs> let's say little Phoenix, Arizona, or made $60,000 one week. They worked hard and they did this and that. And the next week it drops to $10,000. No pay, no toilet paper. Longer, the punishment you get is on, you're only as good as the last seven days. Doesn't matter that you've done huge things for the church in the past. So you're only as good as the last seven days. Thursday, two o'clock to Thursday, two o'clock. And that's why the top executives of the church who've served unbelievably with sleep deprivation, working, giving their lives to the church, can be thrown into a dungeon, suppress a person whole. Just like that. When there's big money made, it vanishes to the hierarchy, never to be seen of again. And there's no transparency. Nobody ever audits anything. So when the church get these multi-million dollar donations, there's no, there's no accounting, no transparency, no audits, no, no accountants. Nobody knows where the money goes. Even if somebody did throw out $3 million for ID logs, there's no proof that that ever went to an ID log. Right? So the church, Thursday to Thursday, monitors, above all, revenue. That is the supreme statistic. What does that tell you about a religion? It's... <laughs> It's not thinking about even increasing its own flock. It's thinking about how much money did you get people to cough up. Any large entity, Army, Navy, Air Force, corporate, any large entity for a large group of people working together, value long years of production. In the corporate world, you get a maybe a gold watch or send you off to Hawaii to play golf. Benefits increase, right? Even when you're the big, big five-star general at the Pentagon, the new boot camp guys, they shine your shoes, they wash your car. In Scientology, the longer you are in, the more you are expected to take the whip it's almost, it's in the culture that you're, you know, you know the game. And this Thursday to Thursday, two o'clock is so, it's su such a fixation on only new money, new statistics, that the, I, I want to tell you something, the salespeople at Flag, have drawn in two to three million a week for years. That's how there's a billion dollars here and a billion dollars. Two to three million a week, every week, every week, every week, every week.
called Carol Nyberg, who left the Sea Org. And she said that they now have many RPFs known as boot camps at night. And all the salespeople at Flag that hadn't made their quota Thursday to Thursday had to do little RPF punitive savage cycles till 2, 3 in the morning. So for years if they did well, that doesn't count. The last Thursday to Thursday you didn't make it? Go wash those pans till 1 in the morning. But first of all, all you salespeople, line up. Now, do jumping jacks. Come on, move your body. Press ups. One, two, three. They even had an Israeli military person from Israel forcing the crew to do heavy manual punitive actions. An Israeli military person was cracking a whip. So Carol said, people like Charmaine Rogers, who <laughs> coerced money out of billionaire Bob Duggan by the millions, is doing jumping jacks and press-ups and then go washing greasy pots and pans till 1, 2 in the morning. It's punishment after hours because the last Thursday to 2 o'clock to 2 o'clock, you didn't cut it. What's your production? Why aren't you raking it in for the mother church? Yeah. I've said it before and I'll say it again. It's a rigged casino. You cannot win in Scientology. It's always, what have you done for the mother church now, lately? And from last Thursday, 2 o'clock, to this Thursday, 2 o'clock, What's your production, mate?